Hello everyone, my name is Flabless here and we've returned back once again to Restless Dreams. Now I'm going to hope to try and complete the rest of this game, but in the save file it still says that we're on chapter 1. But I have no idea. Did you have no idea? We can try and complete it in this episode. If not, then it will definitely be on the next episode. And I went back through the game uh, uh, as an earlier point, and there in uh, the. Oh, I've forgotten the name. The artifact room. There was only two pieces of paper that you could pick up from there. And the pieces of paper don't have a name to it, nor do they serve as a event alternator for our friend Tiga, who still died, quote unquote. So that doesn't mean anything for us at the moment, but I don't know if that will have a profound effect on the future, and whether or not going into the room has any profound effect on the future, indeed. Right, so... So, okay, so he said he doesn't want to reread that. Okay, so we're gonna go outside. Got some painkillers just now, which is very nice, which means we can heal ourselves up. But we're still lacking in the food department, and we and our first is at max, so we need time for that because I think first decreases our stats, hunger just allows us to walk and not run at all. I see no reason to hate it. Nope. I don't think you should. Okay, so where did that monster come from? Because I am intrigued. By the way, Shiro, which room is yours? It was room 1005. But you have to enter it from room 1003 because the door is blocked by boxes. Your group did a, your group did a great job securing you. Well, there are all kind of people after all. Enough talk then, let's go. Mm, why is he so adamant to drop him off? Poor kid. He doesn't deserve such wrath from our cold protagonist. So, which is... Okay, where is 100... One, where is 100 starting from then? Um, none of these rooms have a... Oh wait, a door covered by boxes. That'll be our hint for now. It's covered in boxes, which means that it might be further up or it might be below the ground. But we haven't got a key, so my only assumption is that... What? Maybe I was right, this building is about to collapse any time. You don't seem to be set... You don't seem to be that scared. It's been like this for maybe three days, so... I see. Yeah, it's going to collapse soon. Oh dear. But I think it looks like we're going the right way then, if we're following the earthquakes and making them trigger. So in real life, they just trigger on their own when they're ready. But in a game, they trigger... Based on events that happen, either time-based events, or you move to a specific spot, or a specific range of tiles, and then the event activates from there. Okay, so, these must be, you can't be got the handle one even, oh, the handle one even, handle one even turn. Those don't look like boxes though, so it must be in another location. Where, oh, where, oh, where. We need to find a room which has boxes on it, and then that means we're on the right track towards finding this little boy's room. This door is not locked, but something heavy is preventing it from opening from the other side. Okay. Right. This one. We're here. Yeah, thank you for escorting me, Anarchy. Wouldn't mind if I take a look inside, right? Hmm, sure, I don't mind. You don't seem to be a bad guy, but I would still would steal anything anyway. <laughs> After all that cold lines of mine, you still think about me like that? He's too innocent. Shiro used his room key. Hey, just one more thing. What is it? 
You didn't happen to see me lying unconscious in that big hall and took my shank, did you? Huh? You mean the guy was lying dead in the big hall was you? I see. So you're the one who stole my shank. I didn't mean to see it. I thought you already did, so... Well, I don't care about that anymore. It's good to know that you're an honest kid, Shiro. Really? I'm so sorry, Anniki. You may keep it. <laughs> I've already got myself a better weapon! <laughs> Just a minute in your face. My machete is better than your prison shank. Well, thank you, Anniki. Well, open the door, Shiro. You'll be owner after all. Oh yeah, sorry. Hmm, what's this place in? Bottles of mineral water, they're almost empty. I shouldn't take these from that boy. Leftovers, not that I want to eat them. Uh, bottles of mayonnaise, ketchup and soya sauce. Looks like these are the last resort should you have nothing but stale food. It's a salmon jump. Of course I don't want to read it. A uh, box of mineral water, steam and probably some last thing I oh, should, should, I oh, do should need arises. But then the boil die of, uh, you know, they're all rotting. I wonder how could he survive by eating these? They're all rotting. Yeah. Everything is rotting. He's a, um, looks like he's trying to draw some manga. He's a duke of this. Nice. Nice to accomplish. I wonder how long he's, it, okay. Pretty big hole. Enough for sure to go through, I think. But it's blocked by a stack of boxes on the other side. Even if someone's going to pay me a thousand yen, I won't sit on this one. Ah, oh, no water. Uh, so that bathroom is more like an escape route more than anything else. A second, yeah. Hmm. Talk to the boy. Yes. What is it, Anniki? Parents. Where are your parents? They're gone. With monsters? Maybe. I never get to see them until now. Hmm. You never seen them even once? I was raised by my grandmother. She said that both of them asked her to take care of me when I was two years old. You still remember their faces? No, I don't remember them anymore. I also don't remember my mum's face. Not when I know. Okay. Cold person. Yes, what is it, Anarchy? You really like manga, huh? You really like manga, don't you? Oh, of course. I've read tons of them before all this started. How about you, Anarchy? Well, not really. I'm just a casual reader. <laughs> Why are you looking at me like that? I don't know, but you have so many things here. So many items. You sure have a lot of items here? Well, it's not that hard to collect them as long as you know when to scavenge for them. By the way, how did you find out the bee holes are only active at night? Ah, a man named Scott told me about it. He's really cool. Scott, the guy who disappeared mysteriously before this place got overrun. Um, if you want to look for items, I could give you the spare master key to the ninth floor, Anarchy. Yeah, um, please give me that thing. Here you go, Anarchy. <laughs> Rin took the key from Shiro. This kid's way too innocent about it. endangers himself. I can basically take all the available things here and he'll starve to death because there's nothing there to scavenge. Are you sure that you would do that? Sometimes it's every man for himself. Uh, craft. No, don't need that. Because we've got ourselves a machete. Okay, so we've got room 909. So that means it's the floor below because we're in 100 something. 
Ah, this feeling. There's a vision. A particular room. That was a pretty science. More importantly, that rooftop. Why does it appear in my head? It doesn't seem to be on the rooftop of this building. Maybe another one's. Excuse me. I should find that place. I think the boy will be safe as long as he has methods of escaping. So, um... Oh yeah, so that must be his escape point then. Okay, so our next our next objective is to go down the floor and find room 909. Not that room, though. <laughs> um, there's another place. Um, oh, yeah. We have to go through here and then go down. Uh, where is the center door? Center door. Center door. There's got to be. There we go. There's the center door. I was looking for you. I'm all happy now. Now we need to scout the area and make sure we find this, for goodness sakes, Vane. Found it the first try. <laughs> Whoopee! Good. Now we're in this room, we shall thoroughly investigate to see if we think that it has to offer. Not that, though. Okay, I'm gonna lose my mind in a minute. Uh, check the bathroom first. Oh my god! What the hell are you doing in here, you wretched beast? Don't go in the bathroom. <laughs> Simple as that. There's a military ration inside the box. You took ration. Ah, oh, that's to provide for food served to military personnel. Well, we're not military, but we could be considered that. I don't know. Our uniform. There are two strawberries left inside the box. Minor improvements to our hunger and thirst. Uh, slightly to relieve your hunger first. Your hunger and first. A red, somewhat heart-shaped fruit. No, they are heart-shaped. Uh, what's in here? Nothing, nothing. These are women's fashion magazines. Hmm. Why? Well, it's rather bizarre to see, like, see things like this, actually. Why? Um, there's a laptop screen on. The candle is lit. There's a laptop on the table. Um, that will probably be important when the full game releases. It won't budge. Right. Anything else? Maybe we do need to investigate the bathroom, but at least we know that there's a monster inside there. Go and die, you wretched fiend. Dirty towel, it smells like a towel that was used to wipe sweat, so then left, okay. Uh, that. Oh, good, we're not trapped there. I just realized that this thing will recover in time. Don't know if that'll affect us here and now. Uh, look in the box, nothing but empty bottles. Are you sure? A mattress. The bed isn't warm. Seems it must be sleeping in for a week. Uh, things here, here. The candle is lit. It won't budge. Nothing left inside the box. Nothing left inside the box. That. Candle is lit. Box. Is there absolutely nothing in this room that we can take? So what's the purpose of coming in here in the first place then? If we can't do anything, or if we haven't collected anything special. If anything we've got are rations and strawberries. Okay, without a claw on my rations. Uh, ration! Ration A. Okay, now we have stopped running. Who day? Now we're gonna go like a snail. Snail paste! 
and we are beloved by Rat. Let's see if we. Uh, it'd probably be wise to go back to our friend on the tenth floor. I uh, just need to find the stairs again. If we can find the stairs, at least. But do I need even budge? Okay, fine. Thank you very much for that confirmation. I shall just go on my merry way, and hopefully, we'll never see that forsaken problem ever more, ever again. Uh, go through here. I love how he compliments means I'm not even alive. It's all good in this world. If it's sturdy and well made, he has no reason to hate it or complain. This is job. Oh, okay. We need to use it on the other door as well. Hi. Right. my brew, you fools. What have been here? Nope, nothing in here. Flushed it manually. Eeks. Human consumption is one of the biggest problems in these sort of wars. There are three bottles of vodka in your box. Nice. Lovely. <laughs> well, that kid's not going to drink these anyway. Good. Okay, can we. It won't budge. Okay, so it's locked from both sides. That's fine with us because we don't need to go that way anyways. His head's over the wall. Nothing but trash inside. Won't budge. We can use it on this one as well. Maybe these are... It's, it's not a specific room, but it's for a specific section of the building. Let's try and get it. We'll read this first. It's a manual on how to craft craft bullets. I should memorize this. It'll definitely come in handy later. Written on how to craft bullets. During dream sequences, usable bullets are rarely found. Rin has to craft his own bullets. By combining gunpowder and empty bullets, an ammo box will be crafted. Empty bullets can be found anywhere, although they're rare. They may also be found in those creature corpses. Gunpowders can be found like regular items. Gunpowder may also be useful later. You may choose to save them for later. Or use them for crafting. There are two pouches of gunpowder inside. So you're saying that creatures can also hold items. That'd be useful. So maybe if there is a purpose for killing, but then we'll use up healing items. Risky decision there. Either to do them for survival purposes, or for not doing that, or conserving your healing items, because you don't have an infinite supply of either, but at least we can survive without uh, needing to heal ourselves of our thirst and hunger, if so be. You shall be, won't budge. Use the master key for this room. Hi there. Okay, we are really on the brink here. Okay, use that. And now we can go past. The candle is lit. Okay, there's a supreme glue inside. What does this glue do, though? What can we do with the glue? What can we do with the glue? Follow Supreme Glue Juice Superior's performance with Spain is a perfect material for combining things. Oh, good doggy, that's good. So, right, so we've run out of. We've run out of. I'm running out of words, actually. The candle is there. There's a box just full of empty shake bottles. Empty is not good. Filled is better. Right, bed. Bed is warm. That's fine. Right, so we can, we can, we can. We don't even budge. That's fine. A box is filled with sand and dirt. Oh yeah, we could we have just scat, search for corpses.
No, we can't. Maybe these corpses don't have anything in them. Okie dokie. Let's press onward, Jane. Let's press onwards to the next room. Okay, this room's already open. Just, the door just won't even budge. That's my problem. Nothing here either. Okay, so I think we've pretty much got everything. We just need to go around the other side now, go back upstairs and talk with Shiro. Hints given. Oh, okay. Haha, <laughs> I think I could jump down there. I didn't, e I didn't even try to explore this. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, fine. Found it, found it. Okay, we need to find a healing item. Oh my god, where did you come from? Where did you come from? Sheesh. Oh my god, we need to find a healing item. I don't care what it is. I don't care if it's, a, if it's just a hemostate. We need to find a healing item and we need something quick. Going around the other side is just going to be complete suicide. There's just no way we're going to survive this. No. We need to do something else. We need to find something which we can heal ourselves with. Um, hunger, no. First, no. Hunger and first, no. Food served to military personnel. That doesn't say if it does anything, though. Damn it. I don't want to even... It's our only option through that door. But if we fight that other monster, we're going to die. Because our health is literally critical. I can't see two feet in front of me. I feel like I'm gonna die if I go through there. God, why is this particular scenario so limited on the healing items? We only got painkillers in this scenario. How the hell could anybody be able to do that? What the hell? We need to go through here fast. Oh. Okay, that's good. That's good for us. Oh my god. What's happened here? What's happened here? Okay, I'm gonna save first, just in case one of these rooms have something nasty to surprise us with. Uh, trash, tissues and paper, nothing else. No healing items. Oh, pair of scissors. We can use those. Just need bandages now. Oh, water. We can get water out of water. Ah, oh, okay. It won't turn on. It won't turn on. Piece of papers, but I don't need them. This is one of the main gas notebook. They're here. They're here. They're here. Those creatures are all going to die. The black cloud. No, 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 no. It disintegrates everything. The black cloud. What the hell could that mean? Saiyan jumps. Sure, my life is. Can't you pick him up for him? It's just nice to be grateful to other people than just always yourself. Of course, he wouldn't do that. Our friend, our protagonist, would not care in the world. He cares in his own survival. There are various titles of manga on the shelf. Perhaps these are the group's one shots. Oh, okay. Are oh, these just bookshelves? It's just bookshelves, or kip. Brojo's bizarre experiences, close days, prey, ex prey. Are oh, these what people usually call do -dangy? I believe I call that right. This corpse looks similar to the corpses outside. Well, yeah, I think they all look the same. Bones and blood. Just in different formations, depending on what the creature wanted at the time. It's futile. There's no electricity. There's, there's nothing. There's nothing in this place. Okay, so let's check the other side. Okay, if we can, that is. We can't! Oh. Is it just me or can I hear the faint sound of water hitting a shore from inside? 
It's just me or my imaginative veins. <gasps> yes! Oh my gosh, more painkillers. Good. We can use these for ourselves. Good. What the? Oh my gosh, okay. Still chapter one. Oh my gosh. Even though they're healing items, we can't use them otherwise we just die. Well at least you've seen what happens if you overdose on painkillers. Golly. We have healing items, but we can't use them. Right. So we can only use these once chapter two starts. But we can only use it once chapter two says it started. It's a book of tours. They offer Korea, China, Thailand, Europe. Well, I'd rather visit Hakuro than go on, a t go on a tour. Okay. Nothing of interest. I was wanting to look at that machine there. Of course, there's no electricity. It's full of brochures, travel plans, and several other documents that don't seem to be that important. Not in a survival situation. These all should be filled with useful items. There's no water left inside the dispenser. Full of brochures. Oh gosh. I thought we was given a blessing, but we're just given a jinx. Uh overdosage on painkillers. Not good. Not good at all. Something over there. Right, budge. We can go through this one though. Um, is there anything we can use for healing? Anything that we can use for healing without dying? This for the blank papers and references. And rejected drafts as well. There's no water left inside the dispenser. Good thing this one's still working. I don't need it for the time being. Fine, we'll save in here then. For the lulls. This notebook. What language is this? Hell. Calculus is more understandable. Okay, so it seems like it's a book, but oh, there are lots of video game discs on the shelf. Uh, this that's very useful. Several empty discs inside. We'll take them. Be more useful in the uh nothing interesting since the computer's no power. Nothing interesting. Uh, nope. Okay, they'll be more useful in the main game. This must target finish all the mapping. Did they manage to finish it? <laughs> Is that a reference for the developer themselves? I don't know. <laughs> to finish the mapping. I wonder if that's a quote where the developer... Well, no quote. I mean, uh, a blog or a tweet or something that they put out that they need to finish this month. Um, what kind of abomination is this? I don't know, but I think we're in a spot of bother. Oh my god, there's something there. I have no idea what that is. We best not get caught by those. It's on the other side of the room, so that's good. I'm glad. There's only one of those. What if... What if... Whether if it's apocalypse or not, I should need to... Okay. <laughs> oh, glad of that. We're descending further. I can dive in here if I want to. Yeah, dive. Oh my, okay. Okay, so we're on a time limit and I can't see. Can't see. It'd be useful if we can run. Uh... I've never had this mechanic before within a game. Underwater scenario. Oh my god, no, 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 no. That thing's right there. We didn't have the manpower to fight that sort of thing. Right. Oh my gosh, this is terrifying. Right, barge. Oh. Right. 
switch inside. Switch on. Oh, just... Hmm. We need to... Uh, so, we need to decrease the water level first before switching that on, I presume. So, that's going to be it for today. I don't think we'll proceed that much further into the game, but we're definitely going to get some progress done in the next episode because I'm going to explore around an underwater scenario and hopefully we're going to find some sort of item that allows us to be healed without killing us. So, thank you very much for watching, folks, and we shall see each other in the next time of Restless Dreams. This is definitely a experience. Have a good day and take care of yourselves.